what's going on guys simple Florida fishing here and today we are doing some morning fishing before work it is a little bit past 5 30 a.m. I gotta be at work at 9 and we're gonna see what we can get in uh, neighborhood canals this morning so let's get at it all right guys we're at the first spot it's a little bit dark don't know if you're able to see this or not but we're just throwing a z-man razor shed on a 3 out 1 16th ounce hook well, let's see what happens Just spooked the snook right there. Don't know if you can see that. It's a whole bunch of finger mullet. I bet you there's gonna be a bunch of snook. So, we made it to a little canal spot. Going for some snook, possible tarpon as well. Let's see what we can get. Ooh, I just got whaled by something huge. First cast. Big fish, big fish, big fish. There was just a big fish. I think it's a big snook that's just sitting up in there. Yeah, he really wants to see that they got whacked. Ooh, big fish. I'm talking 40. I don't know where he went. Ooh, fish. Got it. That's a nice one. That's probably, okay, don't break me, don't break me. It's probably 26, 27. Could be a slot, I'm not sure. No, it's not. Okay. Don't break me here. This is how they always break me, always. Start thrashing, taking drag, and that 20 pound breaks. I should be using 25. This is a good one. It's gonna come up again, I think. Right over here. Here he is. Oh, okay. Nice. Nope, nope. Don't break. He's probably 26. If I had to guess. Lighten up on him. This is where they break you. Nope. Nope, no. Ooh. Tire him out. Nope. I'm trying to bring me that little weed pile right there. Come on. He might be a little bigger than I thought. He could be a slot, but I don't think so. I want to say he's like 26. On that Z Man Razor Shad weedless rig. I need to get a pair of fish grippers again. This guy's probably 26 all day. Beach him right here. All right, there we go. I would call that a snook landing. Yeah, he's probably, he could go 27. Bring him up in the light here. Oh. Oh. 
Not bad at all. How's that? Definitely probably 26 and a half, 27. That's a good one, man. On that, uh, on that Z-Man Razor shit. These hooks so weird. I don't know how he even got hooked like that. Alright. Get this guy back in. Last look at him. Good canal snuff, probably 26, 27 inches. I said in the last video always want to retie and always check your leader after catching a snook so my leader is chafed all the way to about right here so that's a good four inches I gotta cut off but Let's go try another spot. I'm thinking a little bridge. Alright guys, so pulled up this little bridge here. Usually I get some snook here, um, jump tarpon here. I've seen people catch tarpon. Just the other day I actually saw a black drum here. There's redfish here, so just kind of a little gamble here with backwaters. See what we can get. Chuck this under the bridge. All right, let's head to a different spot. Alright guys, so we just arrived at this little pond and if you know this location, don't you dare comment it because your comment will get deleted immediately. But um, I'm already starting to see some fish bust, so let's see if we can get something on the Z-Man uh, Razor Shad. Scooped at my feet. Oh, not really that big, probably 20 inches, but still. Z-Man razor shot. Such erratic action. I think a 16th ounce weight is just about perfect for it. You can even use an eighth, but anything lighter is just going to drag the top. Anything heavier is just going to drag the bottom. Ooh, he came up for it right there. Right there. It's probably like a 15 inch snook. 15, 18, something like that. Ooh, he whacked it again. Let's see if we can go three for three getting whacked here by the same snook. Nope, not three for three. Ooh. 
I think uh, we're gonna go fish one more spot and then we'll call it a day for this video. All right, I don't know if you guys can see this or not, but there's about a five foot gator right there. And we also got a snook swimming around right here. Stands off the water. Come on, is he on it? I think he's on it. Come on. No? See if there's a snook hiding up there with him. Oh yeah, there is. There's a few snooks sitting next to this gator. Gator's moving now. Look at this guy. Here he goes. Alrighty guys, it is just past 7 a.m. Just got back to the house. I gotta start getting ready for work. But um, I'm gonna get to editing this video when I get home from work. So it should be up on YouTube tonight. Um, so nothing much other than, I mean, we caught a good snook, a great snook. Um, and can't be more happier than that. Great way to start a Monday before work for sure. But. Um, yeah, hopefully we um, get some more content, uh, maybe even another video tomorrow morning. Um, but as always, you guys stay safe, keep fishing, and tight lines.